up guys, it's Bad Reviews Co here back with another video. Today I will be reviewing what gloves I use in a game and what gloves I use in practice and just the gloves I use, okay? So let's these are the gloves I've been using for the least amount I have had a glove is six months in this collection. Um, I'm gonna be having four gloves. I have four gloves. I actually have more, but these are the gloves I use mostly, like, on a regular basis. So, let's get right into it. So first, I'm going to start out with my infielder's mitt. I use this glove for pitching and um, second base. I'm a second baseman. So, yes, I love this glove. It's a nice glove. I got it steamed, though. Never get a glove steamed. It's really the worst thing you can do to a glove, and it's just the gloves all stiff now. Some like the laces are like all dried out, and the stitching and all that is all dried out, and it's just really not what you do. But my glove blew up, and I had to steam it, or I wasn't gonna be able to play the next day in the middle of a tournament. That is literally the worst thing that can happen, but it did. So that's what happened. Um, I've had this glove for about, maybe, let's see, about eight months now. I love this glove. It's just not what it could be because I have steamed it. Uh, if I could choose any infielder's mitt I would get, I would choose an A2000. Um, Elijah, the other person that does the videos with me. He couldn't make it, but he has an A2000 Zoom Fairers Mint, and that's what he uses. Yeah, I like I like his glove so much, but yeah, I just can't. I had to get this glove because it was last minute, and I didn't want to steam an A2000. So let's get to the next glove. My next glove I'll be using is a my Outfitters Mint. It's a Mizuno. It's a Mizuno Pro GMP-10. This is a limited edition one. Its standard price is about 350 bucks. The first one I looked at, 150 bucks. That's how much that one cost. This one cost 350 bucks. Very expensive, but very worth it. This club is made with really, really nice leather. And it's just a well-built built glove in total, general. Well-built well glove in general. It looks amazing. It's just a little beat up. I've had this glove for about a year now, and I've used it a lot. And but that's what gloves are meant for is to use them. So that's how this. That's the story on this glove. Um. Uh, for the next glove, I have a review on it, so you can go check that out in the description below. And. Let's go to the next one. The next glove will be the A2000 Catcher's Mitt. I have a review on this already. I'm going to get a review on these other two gloves. We have one more, but you don't really want to know about that one. Um, This one I've had for about six months. This is the newest glove I have. It's the nicest glove I have ever had. I love this glove like with all my heart. It's like my baby. I won't even let it stay with all of them and outside in the garage. It has to be inside. If I could recommend any glove, I would recommend this A2000 Catcher's Mitt. It's just hands down the best glove I've had. They're so well built, they're so reliable, and they look good too. So, there's a reason they're worth 350 bucks and just really expensive. Definitely a reason. It's a really nice glove and I just, there's, I'm just speechless about this glove, it's just, there's not words that can describe how amazing this glove is. You have to own one to know. Um, I would recommend this glove any day. If you're more experienced, definitely get this glove, but if you're just getting into baseball, don't get this glove. Get the next glove I'm about to show you. But anyway, this is my A2000, have a more, have a better review in the description below I'll link it and let's go to the next one. The 
The next glove is my old catcher's mitt. It, I use this glove in practice. It's a Rawlings SCM33CB. It's tw 23 inches. Oh no, 33. 33 inches. It's 33 inches. It um, It's just really old. I've had it for about maybe two years now. It, it's very reliable. It's like the most reliable glove I have besides the A2000 because I just got that glove. But any beginners definitely get this glove. It's not bad. It's not a bad glove. For a hundred bucks, you're getting a glove that will last two years. It still works. It's not like nothing's wrong with it. And you're just going to get a good glove all around. It's not as good as the A2000 all around, but it's still a really nice glove. It's um, it's one of the gold glove like models. It says that, but like don't I think Rawlings puts that on every single one of their gloves. So I really don't know to this point. It says Sandlot in the middle. It says Little Toe because that's what it is, and it's Pro Design. It says. So yeah, this is that glove. That's that's that. This is all my gloves. I hope y'all like this video. Uh, I have one more thing to say. So we are going to come out with merchandise soon. So it's it's gonna be a big step. I know it's not gonna be soon. It's gonna be like in six months. As soon as we hit a thousand views we are going to come out with a, a hoodie or a t-shirt a long sleeve t-shirt we have not decided yet but that's what we're going to come out with and i hope y'all like it if y'all do if y'all like that idea like put a like i mean smash that like button and put, uh, tell us that you want the merchandise and we're also thinking about our logo. If any of y'all can make a logo or something and send it to us and we'll might like we might choose something or or use your design and our logo or something like that, just just to be one on one with you guys, because I know that I'm not gonna make a logo that I like and then someone else doesn't like it. I just I just think we should all come together and make a logo. Um because we're going to need that logo once we hit a thousand views because I got to have something to put on this sweatshirt or shirt. So if y'all like this video, make sure to leave a like. Click the subscribe button if you're new. Turn on those bell notifications when we post. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.